Okay, dogs, get it go. Dogs, get it go. No, oh, I didn't want that. Why? Because I have blankets in the bottom we haven't sold. <laughs> trying to keep them out. I want to get the boxes. Huh? The box is going. No, it's, it's not. What? Triple Hulk is two. Yeah, it's no. It's no. No good. No, you're not coming in here. I'm not gonna play that. No. Okay. Hello everybody! I know I didn't do a, I didn't do a, a, a um, yeah, an events planner. Hi Christy! Hi Christine! Hi Deb! Hi Elaine! Merry Christmas! Hi Kim! Hello Cheryl! Tina! Joni! You almost forgot! <laughs> Everybody make sure that you like and share the post. Awesome, Joni. <laughs> Glad that it's working. <laughs> I hate when it's not working. Yeah, I don't know how many of each color I have. Just... I guess it had a problem thing on it. Deb Betrell said, Merry Christmas. Yes, Merry Christmas to everybody. Bad storm rolling in tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I, it's supposed to be here uh, Thursday night, I think. Right? Yeah. Thursday night. Kim Brown sent 50 stars. Yeah, I, I you guys it. will have to tell me if we're having a stars party because for some reason I can't see it anymore. Yeah, and I don't even have my stuff out. Huh? I was trying to count them, and I don't have my stuff out. I'll pass you a couple. I can do Kim. Hi, Linda. Yeah. I got you, Kim. No. You get in there. <laughs> Thank you, Linda. Thanks, Christy. It's made by Viva's Caps and uh, Visors and Caps. I think I got that right. <laughs> hey, Stace. <laughs> anyway, anyone else obsessed with Dr. Pole? No mares. I watch it quite often. Yeah, no mares. <laughs> hey, Will. All Pam, huh? Welcome, welcome, anyways, wherever you're from. Here, no, Karen. I mean, uh, Kim. You hear Doug's cop shows. Doug's not here. <laughs> I thought he turned the TV down, but. Yep, that's Massachusetts. I'm from Tewksbury, so <laughs> I'm a Duggan. <laughs> I 
Thanks, Joni. All right, so we got some people on here. That's Massachusetts. All right, you guys, we have these saddle covers. They're Western saddle covers. They got the horn. They do not have the stirrups, but they do have the elastics that go underneath the um, skirting. All this fits inside. Can you pick one? So I'm going to have to put this, pack this one. I won't, I won't open it all the way up. Just take it out of the bag. It looks like this. All packs right into this horn right here. Hi, Vicky. Use your blinker. <laughs> All right, so these here are going to be $8 tonight. Really cool saddle covers. We have purple, blue, and green. Purple, blue, and green. One green. Only one green. Oh, then we get this. Oh, maybe. I like a pink. No, it's purple. That's oh, purple. Yeah. Hey, Vicky. You had relatives in Newburyport. Yep, I'm from Tewksbury. I'm one of the Duggins from Wilmington. Moved all the way up here in the sticks. Well, I like it. <laughs> Anybody interested in any Western saddle carriers tonight? Well, it's not carriers, covers. They're $8. $8 for the cover. Cheryl Pasillo would like a purple. The Massachusetts <laughs> Stacy Montalvo would like a purple. You're from Wilmington, Mass, Cheryl. <laughs> there you go. It's a small world, isn't it? <laughs> ah, good for me to get out of the ghetto. Well, I don't know about the ghetto, but I I kind of grew up in New Hampshire, anyways. I'm from Mass, but. <laughs> So we have blue, purple. I have a blue one. There's one that's already half out of the bag somewhere. Nope. Okay. It's coming out. It was like already ripped. Okay. These are like two blues. No, well, there's a whole bunch. And that bucket. Blue? Yeah. Did you blue? look in the bottom? Isn't that blue? We have blue, purple. And green, those are purple. Yeah, there's no blue. Just them two. I don't know. You got something setting on some? No. Because I thought there was a blue that was ready to come out of the package. No. It was, because I was going to keep it. It's like in a crinkly pack like that. All right, anyways. We got blue, purple, and one green. One hunter green. I don't know. Martian, you were BFFs. There you go. <laughs> Pittsburgh Pirates. There you go. 
I didn't, but I will right now. I didn't see it, Linda. Oh, there it is. I'm sorry. Linda Woodbury wants a blue. A blue? Yep. Anybody else I miss? <laughs> the sticks is definitely the place to be. <laughs> Hi, Candy. Hi, Laura. Hi, Sherry. So we're showing you saddle covers right now. They are purple. We have purple, blue, and green. One hunter green left. <laughs> Hi, Lori. Welcome, welcome. All right, we have these are ten foot lead ropes. They do have a bull snap. Bull snap. They are 10 foot, three quarter inch lead ropes. They're going to be $9. $9. I only have this one color and I probably have 10 or 12 of them left. They're only in teal. Big heavy brass bull snaps on them. $9. Hey, hey, nothing wrong with English. <laughs> Christine, we have a, one English saddle pad tonight. <laughs> Candy would like two of the lead ropes. Well, Sherry, I started off, I was showing uh, Western saddle covers, and then I just went to lead ropes. That's it. It's as far as I've gotten. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with English, Christine. It's just a whole different personality, of, a whole different level of people. That's all. <laughs> Did anybody see the post I put up today about English English writers and Western writers? The difference is when <laughs> the difference is, is English writers would yell at you if your dog was barking at him to stop your dog and put it away, whereas a Western writer would say, "Throw that Chihuahua at him three or four times. Let's get him straightened out." <laughs> I thought it was funny because that would be me. I'd be like, shoot that gun again. Shoot it again. <laughs> he needs to know that isn't going to kill him. Any more lead ropes? Yes, we are a different breed. <laughs> yes, they are expensive lead ropes. They are cotton. They are 10 foot, 3 quarter inch lead ropes. They are not normally cheap. They're 9 bucks on sale. Hi, Nancy. I think you need a saddle cover. No, you don't? You sure? You don't want any dust on it, do you? What? Why you look scared? Nothing. <laughs> Did anybody else see Norma scared? Because she looks scared. <laughs> well, Sherry, everybody needs lead ropes. Nine bucks for a ten-foot lead rope. Okay, I'm pretty sure I was saying that that was going to Airy. Okay. Well, I had um 
Oops. All right, so we still have these earrings. <laughs> earrings and necklace sets. We're going to let the whole set go for $12 tonight. 12 bucks, you'll get earrings and the necklace. We have black horse, and we have it in the white horse. $12 for the entire set. You're not going to beat that because usually they're like $12 a piece if you look anywhere else at these. Super nice. We have white horse or black horse. I'm going to sell them in the set for $12. I always need saddle covers. Everything I own gets dirty somehow. Where is it? Oh, the last one. Yep, that's the bag it was in. Oh, didn't think we had any left. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna struggle with this for a moment. English horses or Western horses? <laughs> right. <laughs> I can tell you right now, I have one horse that will go English. The rest of them, not so much. I mean, you could probably put an English saddle on them. It ain't going to mean they're going to look good. They're going to be prancing and dancing on wherever they go. <laughs> oh, my God. I can't get this line. Oh, there it is. Say I can't one more time, Sandy. Look what I found. We found one more farrier knife. One more farrier knife. You got your hoof knife. You got your braiding comb, your pulling comb. You got your, your punch, a knife, and a hoof pick. All in one unit. Throw it in your saddlebag, pocket. It's uh, sixteen dollars. Last one. Anybody interested? We won't be getting any more of these in till next year. Sixteen dollars on the farrier knife, and I'm gonna say knife five hundred times just to tick Facebook off. <laughs> <laughs> all right now i gotta find this one because i don't even know All right, we have one of the travel pouches left. These are the teal with the sunflower. They are Montana West travel pouches. They do have a metal zipper on them, which I think is the most valuable asset because I'm a zipper breaker. And they are $23. The sunflowers with the teal and the leopard print. $23, and this is the last one I have left. Are we feeling sassy tonight? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. It's all right. <laughs> $23 on the travel carrier, travel bag. $23 is the last one left, and all we have is the sunflower. It has a teal with the leopard print. Probably am being mouthy tonight. I can't help it sometimes. <laughs> Poor Norma. We'll do this. 
Yep, let's do this. It's right here. I gotta look and see how much it is because I have no clue. This is the last pad we have left. And it is $18. It's an equine couture wave dressage saddle pad with rope trim. Look at this. Look at these corners. Fancy, fancy. Those are um, like clear crystals. Which I can't make them show up. Anyways, $18 for this dressage pad. I only have this one left. I had a couple different ones, but they all sold privately, so. Hi, Allison. Two storms back to back. We're supposed to get another bad one Thursday into Friday this week. I know, we're supposed to get rain here, too. It's going to be crappy. How come I can't see Linda Whitford? Linda Whitford, if you're posting something, post with an emoji because you seem to be getting filtered out. This is a brand new equine couture saddle pad. It does have this neat detailing trim on it and it has the rope trim all the way around. $18. If anybody's interested, let me know. It's a dressage saddle pad. Kathy, you want it? Okay. Kathy Solka. Okay. Oh. You got it, Kathy. Okay, I have two monkey butt powders left. They are $7.95. All I have is the regular. Thank you, Nancy. <laughs> okay, thanks, Sherry, because I can't see her. That's what I was wondering. I couldn't see her, so I just don't want her to be trying to buy something and me not be able to see it. My burn's looking nasty, huh? <laughs> All right, so we got two of the anti-monkey butt powders left. They are $7.95 each. So we have Furazone. It's in a one pound container. It's a water soluble antibacterial topical ointment, aids in the prevention and treatment of surface bacterial inf infections and wounds, and cut cutaneous ulcers of horses. May also be used as a sweat. So I always use these. I had a horse that every summer, I don't know why, she'd always get rain rot. It's like they have running shit. They come in at night, but it, she's outside for five minutes in the rain. She gets rain rot. So anyways, this stuff works good for that. It is 1990, oops, I forgot now. 1995 for the container. Thank you, Candy. Nineteen ninety five for the Furazone container. It's the yellow stuff. Gotta leave this sitting straight up. Because it's all Yeah. <laughs> 
How many of these do we have left? Here? All I can see is just that one. Okay. Yeah. That's all I can see. All right, we have some three cup feed scoops. Yeah, it works good, Joni. It works good, no doubt. I have some in my barn. Actually, the bottom corn is busting off the off the jug, so off the containers. <laughs> I've dropped it on the concrete floor. <laughs> Not good for those little jugs. <laughs> okay, the feed scoops are five dollars. These are the small ones. This is a three cup feed scoop. It says it's two cups, but it's actually three. I don't care what they say. They don't tell the truth. The two cup mark is only halfway up this scoop. Allison Simpson wants the Furazone. Feed scoops. These are great if you're feeding um, minis or horses that don't get a lot of grain. Um, I use one of these to feed my supplement. What else? Dog food scoop. Bird food scoop. You know, $5 for the scoops. I got a bunch of them. I'm holding off on this for a minute. I'm not sure about it. Oh, I guess we still have one of these. We have one red horse carabiner. Oops, there he is. One red horse carabi carabiner. He is four dollars. Merry Christmas, Kathleen. Four dollars on the red horse carabiner. Carabiner carabiner keychain. Four of them. We have the shed flowers from Epona. Uh, they're normally six fifty-two. We're gonna sell them for six and six twenty-five. Allison wants the horse carabiner right here. So six twenty-five. They're usually six fifty-two for the Epona shed flowers. Really handy shedding tool right here. Time's coming. The days are gonna start getting longer. I'm so excited. I have four of them left. Oh, two more down here. All right. So all these brushes are $5 each, right? These here have the handle on them, lightweight plastic. We have pink with the blue, two of them. We have a lime green with the pink. We have orange with pink. They're kind of wonky. And then we have one lime and one orange, solid. They're five dollars each on the brushes. Five dollars each on those brushes. Just let me know what color you want. We also have the red stiff brush. They have the rubberized handle. They are six dollars. Red brush, they have the rubberized handle, they're stiff. I guess I forgot to turn my sound off, guys. Sorry. <laughs> You'll be hearing horse nickering and all kinds of stuff going on. <laughs> stiff brush, six dollars. Are these the only two I've left? Yeah. All I have is two left. Two left. All right, we have one five-mile DC fence charger. 
This is DC operation, which means it runs off a battery. Um, if you're camping, you can just use your car battery, your truck battery, um, or you can use um, a marine marine battery. I don't know. It's brand new. I took it out of the box. I was going to keep it. I know, right, Kathleen? But I got a ton down there. I don't need any. <laughs> Everybody else will be needing them. So it's DC powered, five mile fencer. Um, really simple to set up. You just screw these right on to your fencer, your fence charger, your fence battery. I don't know what, I don't know what my problem is tonight. I can't think straight. <laughs> Anyways, I paid a hundred and I think a hundred and a quarter for this. I'm gonna sell it for ninety bucks. Ninety dollars for the fencer. Okay, Linda, I don't see you. Thank you, Sherry. Linda uh Whitford would like a red stiff brush. <laughs> how long does a battery charge usually last well it all it really depends on how um how long you're going to keep it on if it's what your battery is so like a six volt battery if you just use a regular six volt battery it won't last as long as if you have a marine battery so that's what i'm told <laughs> I don't know exactly how long the charge will last, but I mean, I bought it to go camping and I'm no doubt in my mind that it would last all weekend. So other than that, that's all I can tell you. Unless I look it up. I actually bought it for me, but I decided to go with a battery, a regular D cell battery one just for one horse. So not gonna mess around with the car battery Wednesday I don't I think we're getting it Thursday Kathleen here I think it's coming Thursday night into Friday but I think we're supposed to get rain it's supposed to warm up all right so these here are to hang your manure forks your shovels and whatnot just nail it straight to the wall, put your handle up in there, all set. These are going to be $8, $8, $8 on the horseshoe rack. No blizzards. Yee. All right, next item. This is the incense set. It's gonna be five dollars. Incest, incense, incest, incense ash catcher set. That's all that. And they're five dollars. You get all these incense and the glass tray. And I can't read. The writing's too small for me to read what, um, what scents they are. All right, so these here are winter riding gloves. They are extra, extra small. Extra, extra small. And they are $5. $5 winter riding gloves. They got the pebble grip. Five dollars. Hooked up as a permanent setup. An interstate battery. Only had to recharge the battery once throughout a winter. Okay. Awesome, Stacy. Thank you. I wasn't sure because my mine's mine's a regular plug-in one that I use all the time. And then the one I used to take camping with me, I it always was the um the D cell battery kind. So I never got this kind before, and I was just like, ugh, that's too much, too complicated for me. 
So I suppose that charger would be awesome if you if you house your horses other places. Um, I was going to use it. I got another field next door here, and I was going to use it over there, but I figured out how to get my fencer to go over there. So, yep. Camping. Solar, yep. I don't think I get enough sun around here for much solar. Pimple grip, extra, extra small gloves, $5. What did you say? I have no idea, Joni. It's always something coming out of my mouth. <sighs> Pimple grip, extra, extra small riding gloves. They are winter gloves, $5. They got some nice soft material on the inside. Five dollars. Any you ladies have really small hands or uh, kids that are riding, taking winter lessons. Ninety dollars is a steal for it because I, I told you already what I paid for it, and that's like my price. Okay, so we have the Chicago Screw Packs. You're going to get um, 10 assorted sizes per bag. They are $3.50 a bag. $3.50 a bag for the Chicago Screws. The summer always goes too fast. <laughs> always around here. Chicago screw packs, three dollars and fifty cents. Susan Redfield, <laughs> we talked her into it. Susan Redfield will take the fence charger. <laughs> it's a good deal. got the boots and the spurs on it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, does one show better than that? Or, I mean, in the front? Because it's two the same. Oh, no, that one's the cream colored. Same thing, boots and spurs. Okay. Okay, I give up. Size 81. Tough Rider Bonum 1200D medium weight standard ne standard neck turnout blanket. Um, it is waterproof, breathable. It's Eclipse and Quizelle color, whatever that is. And it is a size 81. $83 for this one. Oh, okay. Candy. Okay, wait a minute. People want stuff. <laughs> Carrie Hildesheim wants two bags of Chicago screws. Okay. Yeah, I'm typing still. Yep. Slow. Uh, Candy Gangrith would like two. Yep. I think that's it. 
Because there's some nutrients in the bottom. Yep. You're welcome, Candy. Carrie, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, uh, yeah. I'm not, I'm not having one of them things tonight where nothing's going right. And, yeah, I just can't get it right. All right. This, these are some super nice winter blankets right here. They are waterproof, breathable winter blankets made by Tough Rider. These, I only have large sizes in these. This one here is an 81. I didn't take it all the way out, Mama. It's all good. <laughs> I just want, I want to get this right now. It's a Bonum 1200D medium weight standard neck turnout blanket. Memory foam with relief wither padding. Str stretchette panels for enhanced movement. Low cross singles with T-hooks. Adjustable removable leg straps. Large tail flap. Waterproof breathable. And all around reflective trim. This is a size 81. And it is $83. $83. Wow, that's right. And I didn't even break the zipper yet. <laughs> that. All right. This is your Tough Rider. Size 81. We've had them the last three years. Yep. It's a nice heavy duty blanket right there. Even though it says medium weight, feels like a heavy weight. <laughs> All right. So I have two other Tough Rider blankets, and they are pretty much the same. This is 220 grams fill, which is considered medium, standard neck, standard trim, waterproof breathable material, turnout horse size, and it is a size 84. Now this one here is the sea blue and tomato red, and it has boots and spurs on it. Boots and spurs and stars and stuff. It's called the Western theme. It is by Tough Rider. It's also $83, and this is a size 84. Size 84 on this one. Cat Hodges sent a hundred stars. How do you spell last name? H O D G E S. Okay. Yeah. These are super nice heavyweight blankets. Well, it's called medium weight, but they're pretty heavy. This is a size eighty four. 83 bucks. <laughs> and then we have this one here is called Toasted Almond and Rawhide. That's the color. This one here is a size 78. This here is also, this is a size 78. And you see right there, that there is your shoulder gussets. Star party. Okay, everybody sending stars. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, I even got nothing. <laughs> Allison Simpson. I'm doing some. Oh. I got my own. Allison Simpson sent 200. I got to get these gloves off right Linda Woodbury. I got you, Linda. That 
Allison, what was last? Simpson. S-I-M-P-S-O-N. I'll do two of hers. to uh, Allison's and Linda's one. How we doing on the star party, guys? Not good? I don't know why I can't send stars anymore. I can't even send stars to my own star party. I don't know why that's like that. Stars party, guys! Stars party. Send stars. Send stars. Linda Woodbury sent another 50. You got her? Yeah. Yay. How close are we? I can't. I hate not being able to see it. I got to find out why I can't see it. <laughs> Thank you, cat. How are we doing in the stars party, guys? I can't see it. It's bugging me. Got to hop in the shower. Then we come with them with <laughs> Jerry. <laughs> Can anybody else see Linda Whitford when she comments? Because I can't see her. I can't see her. Hey, Linda, I see you. Did I scare you? I scared my fish. Allison Simpson sent another hundred. How close are we? I just saw Linda. Sherry, you're so sweet. Go get clean. <laughs> I saw that. I saw it. Now, can somebody tell me about the star party? How are we doing with that? How many more stars do we need? Nobody? Allison Simpson sent another 50 stars. Thanks, Allison. <laughs> I'd still like to know how I'm doing on the star party. We out of time? 150 to go. All right. That gives us a number to shoot for. 150 to go. <laughs> go like a flash, right? Wish I could send stars, I would send them. <laughs> can't believe I can't send stars. A hundred to go. Oh, we gotta make it. Jennifer Chilcote sent fifty. Oh, we're good. Linda Woodbury sent another 100. I'll get Linda. And Jennifer sent another 50. So. I spelled that last name. C-H-I-L-C-O-T-E. And Linda Woodbury, I got you. We must have made it, right? I can't get them because I don't. <laughs> okay. I can't even see. I can't get them either on mine. I don't know why. I have to look. Linda, I just got you for your two. And Bobby Hagerman said she will take the first blanket that was... A, we got them all. Awesome. She'll take the first blanket that was a size 81. It was that solid color one, okay. I think. So, Bobby...
Yep, they're all $83 for these blankets. I don't pay through Google. Well, I don't either. Is that why I don't... I used to be able to send them, though. This is your tan color, almond color with the boots and stars. And then you have the skirting, which is the brown. Thank you, everybody. We got all our stars. All right. Now these ones here. I should have only three left, right? I only have three left, right? Yep. 68, 74, and a 78. Yep. All right. So these here are 1,200 denier, and they are 300 grams of fill. It's a turnout blanket, um, waterproof and breathable material, open front with two nylon buckles with swivel cloth snaps and Velcro for quick and secure fit closure. Double sir single belly and back leg straps uh, with shoulder gussets. Now these ones here are $72. I only have them in black. And I have a size 74, a, a 68, a 74, and a 78. And they are $72. They ask you to pay through your Google account? Really? I think mine, mine pays through PayPal or whatever I choose. Hmm. The other ones, uh, the other blankets. Those were, I don't know, Roberta, are you looking for big horse blankets? Because those are a size 78 and an 84. They're Tough Riders. This here is the size 78. It has the boots and spurs on it. That is your shoulder gusset. They are waterproof and breathable. They have 220 grams of fill. Standard neck. Uh, turn out waterproof and breathable. Low crosser, single adjustable, removable leg straps, straps, large tail flap, and memory foam wither relief. These are a Tough Rider. Western print, two-tone turnout blanket, toasted almond, and rawhide, size 78. Set up an account if you don't take people. Oh, we do. Kathleen, don't worry about it. We do. We do. It's just not my main. I used to, every, I used to do everything through PayPal, and they just screwed me over all the time, so... I don't have anything that small, Roberta. Uh, 74 is the next the next one I have. Kathleen Vanetta is going to take the size 68. That's good. We'll finally be able to send you your prize. <laughs> Kathleen. <laughs> Sorry, Roberta. Yep, the smallest we have left is uh, 74. So we have a 74, two 78s, and an 84. So if anybody's got that really big horse they need a blanket for, we have it. Size 84. You're finally on days. Yay! <laughs> Good, Bobby. How the heck are you? <laughs> Hanging in there. All right, we have the Mrs. Pastures cookies. These are your Mrs. Pastures cookies, America's number one horse treat. The original horse cookie since 1986. All natural ingredients with no preservatives. 32 ounce 
container and it's sixteen dollars. Sixteen dollars for your container of Mrs. Pasture's horse cookies. My horse Jewel Jewel broke out of her stall and smashed one of these containers open and ate all the cookies. That's how bad she is. Norma thinks she's an angel, but she's not. <laughs> she's not. Almost forgot to do that. Twenty four fifty on the Redmond's gold. I don't have any rounders. Nope. Hopefully I'll have some come the first of the year. <laughs> it's just such a big order for me lately. I don't know. I don't make very much we don't make very much off the horse trees and it costs me so much money up front. So the rounders are a hard one, but I'll see if I'll see. Daily Gold, stress relief. Great for your horse's digestive tract. $24.50. It's a four and a half pound bag. Comes with the scoop. If your horse has any stomach upset. Kind of like babysitting. Oh my God. <laughs> Poor Linda. <laughs> All right. We don't have any of the sugar free left, right? Sweet and salty carrot and apple. Yeah. And molasses. Two right apple, in one carrot. I don't have all that. You have only one apple? Yeah. This is totally messed one, up. One, Figures. One apple. One carrot, one yeah. molasses, one sweet and salty, right? Yep. Yeah. All right, we hit it. Twenty-two fifty on the Uncle Jimmy's. I can see you. Carrie Hildesham wants a daily gold. Okay. <laughs> Why is it whenever I go live, this laptop decides it wants to update certain programs like out of the blue <laughs> makes no sense it's not it's not like it's a a windows update it's just like certain programs like they must say well you're on long enough so it's time to update <laughs> Okay, $22.50 for the Uncle Jimmy's Hanging Balls. We have molasses, carrot, apple, and sweet and salty. We have one of each left. One of each left. These are the Uncle Jimmy's Hanging Balls. <laughs> okay, so there's no S. <laughs> Oh, 
Uncle Jimmy's hanging ball. Horse treats. Nobody? About ready to bring them all down my barn and feed them my horses. No one would have a fit. Dang, I know I always make. <laughs> Allison Simpson wants the sweet and salty. <laughs> he missed me, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> Glad you made it back in one piece, Sherry. <laughs> no kidding, right? I get trapped into an update, the stupid thing. <laughs> 2250, Stephanie, 2250 for the Uncle Jimmy's hanging balls. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I always put an S on there? <laughs> she ran the soap over her once or twice. Okay, so we have the Happy Mare um, Veterinary formula, formula Nutritional supplement, supplement. 60 servings, it's a two-month size. Um, stop anxiety, stress, soreness, and irritability in your mare. Developed by a vet, by veterinarian Frank Riley, who I've personally spoke to. <laughs> um, because I sell his stuff too cheap. He got mad. <laughs> Not anymore, I can't do that. They won't let me buy it. Okay. Designed to keep mares calm and relaxed throughout her re reproductive cycles and help her get off hormones and shots. Contains high-dose vitamin E, eight herbs, and two added vitamins and minerals. See improvement within 14 days. This is your happy mare. And map pricing is $58.95. <laughs> uh, Stephanie, I don't have any more sweet and salty left. I have carrot, apple, molasses. and molasses. I can get you for a carrot. Do you want a molasses or... I know, if I've been drinking. <laughs> Even Bill notices my struggle to talk tonight. I haven't been drinking. <laughs> so, Stephanie Llewellyn, let me know... Um, what you, if you want something in replace of the sweet and salty, um, we have molasses and apple. She taking a carrot then? Yeah. I haven't been drinking either. I am definitely struggling to talk tonight. Okay, so she'll take a molasses and the carrot. It has been one of those days for me as well. <laughs> okay, so we have your happy mayor. I forgot how much it was. I'm losing it. $58.95. So the story is here. This Dr. Riley called me out of the blue and informed me that all his products have a map pricing, which is the minimum advertised pricing. Apparently, I was selling under their map pricing and I got caught. <laughs> <laughs> so if I do it again, I won't be able to sell any more of their products. So $58.95 is the map pricing minimum on this. 
Okay, anybody else have, anybody have a moody mare? <laughs> oh, these little boxes. Hold the damn thing over here. It's all right, Norma. Relax. <laughs> You've been drinking. I haven't. Look at the bottle you got beside you. This is my bottle. <laughs> Kathy Raymond made this for me last Christmas. So every Christmas I take it out, but I didn't drink this. <laughs> okay, moving on. <laughs> Cute, right? Yeah, I know. I, I love it. All right, so we have these little gift boxes. There's nothing in them, okay? Nothing but a thingy. They have a little mirror. You can see my phone. You can see where you guys are. Okay, so, yeah, that was fun. He was rubbing off. Norma, Norma, you having a rough night too? Or is it just me? <laughs> so cute little boxes they have little names on them this one here is these are for the wind dancer um briar horses yeah this one is kona with the purple then the blue is sumatra And then the yellow is Sirocco. These are two dollars and fifty cents. What other color am I missing? The pink. The pink. And the pink is Brissa. Okay. Thanks, Alicia. No more rocks, right? No, I haven't even taken my pills yet, Sherry. <laughs> when I take my pills, I'm not allowed to cook anything. I'm not allowed to pay any bills. I'm not allowed to order anything. There's a whole list of things I'm not supposed to do when I take my pills. <laughs> it's scary. All right. Montana West. Tote bags. You don't see enough of Norma. That's because Norma's always hiding. Yeah. She's always hiding. She's got her little Santa Claus Christmas shirt on with her bulldog. She's holding it out for you, but she's not where anybody can see her little bulldog right there. <laughs> oh, Norma, it's so cute. All right, so this is a Montana West tote. Montana West tote. And you're also going to get another Montana West tote inside it. Smaller tote. This, this larger tote is a concealed carry tote. You're going to get both of these totes for $45. Okay, we have it, the black, this is the black, is that it too? yeah, should be another one too, <laughs> we have it in, Kathy, you want that tote bag, so you're saying your pills, I didn't take my pills, I'm acting like I took my pills, but I didn't, Kathy, you want the black one? We have different colors. We have the tan. Comes with the extra one inside. And concealed carry. We have tan. And then we have the brown. 
I got too many handles. <laughs> Okay. And the brown. These are $45. Super nice. Montana West tote bags. Now you're going to get two tote bags with each one of these. Two tote bags. One is concealed carry. The other one is not. Has Aztec print on them. With the little teal concho teal um, spots. Those are $45. Kathy, you want the black one, right? Okay. Uh, I dropped something on when the bottle spilled. Oh, you love it? I'm glad you like it, Vicky. They are nice. They're nice and they last a long time. All right. So these ones here are a little um, smaller. They are not um, concealed carry. They got a, one big pocket on the inside. And it's this stuff. This one here is like but a soft. These, this here is Montana West. We have a black and we have a brown. These are singles. They are $18.50. $18.50 for the Montana West tote. They also come with the little change purse inside. And they do also have a steel zipper. So they come with the little change purse attached. We have the black, and we have it in the brown, or coffee. Like butter, exactly. This is a steel. It's $18.50. $18.50 on these. Super nice. You can see how soft this is. This is like really soft leather. $18.50. Well, Kathy, this is a nice one to have, too. We have two colors. You can get black or coffee. Very good buy. Yeah, no, I stretch them all out, and then Norma tries to fit them back. So they come squished in this little box. Look at it. I can never get this back in there. Norma, she's... She folds them up the way they're supposed to be and gets them back in those boxes. Me, I'd have them hanging everywhere because I would never get them back in the box. <laughs> okay. What else do we have here? How many of these do we have? So, is this one of these? That's the Indian horse. And this one is the bear horse. Okay, so we'll do these right now. These here are $20. These here are your canvas bags. They have the leather hand leather strap. Montana West. These are your canvas tote bags. Well, they're more like a bucket bag. Hi, Janet. I gotta go grab a drink or something. Okay. You got a bottle? Yeah, I got a bottle in there. Just sucked off the bottle, Norma. Twenty dollars. They normally sell for twenty-four ninety-nine. So we have the paint horse here. And all. Happy, I'm opening these. Yes, Donna, they do have a zipper on top. Nice heavy metal zipper, too, at that. 
one thing I like about Montana West, they don't skimp on the zippers or the zipper pulls. I probably shouldn't be zippering this. I'm an animal with these things. Is it twisted? Oh yeah, I got it twisted. I'm trying to zip it and it's twisted. They do have a nice metal zipper, nice big zipper pull on them. And the strap you can remove, change your straps out. It is adjustable, it says Montana West on it. They're just nice. The purse with the three horses. Is that three horses on it? Two horses. This one? <laughs> I'm freaking the firecracker, all right. Oh, Tina Schrader wants the brown. Seeing it now, I didn't see Tina Schrader, like Linda Whitford, the brown in the box, right? The 1851? And Jennifer, Jan, I got you for this one. I'm thinking that's the one she wanted. I don't know how long ago she asked for it. Okay, and Kimberly Haas will take, no, the $45 one. Okay, so not that brown one, the brown one right there with the Aztec. Okay. Yep. Okay, Tina, I got you for that one. Thank you for everybody. <laughs> Thank you for telling me about it. I would have never seen her. Okay, and then this one here is going to Jen Gornardi. So I need the number off of the bag. I don't know if this is the right bag. No, I know. I need the one that's on the bag. M W ten twenty dash eight three six oh cf fluffy we don't need the cf it's fine that is the right bag yeah twenty dollars on that and kim haas wants the black montana west bag which is the one in the small box Okay, I got ya. I got ya. Okay, next we have the Indian paint. Indian paint. This is one of the canvas ones, $20. Awesome, Kim. Glad. Glad I could get you one. I don't know. I told Norma already. Tonight wasn't going to be a really long sale. She said, yeah, well, see, I'm losing my mind. It can't be very long. Jen wants the Indian paint as well. Okay. I called him a bay the other day, but he's definitely a roan. 
He's a roan, or either that, or he's a bay and white. But we'll just call him Roney. He's a roan. Hey, oh, you gotta go lay down. Dog's licking my leg. Go on. Montana West. This is the only one I have left, Donna. The two horse one is gone, and all that's left is this one, which I think this one's pretty. Kathy Soka, you want this one? Would you stop? Come on, you guys. <laughs> Jeez, um. Glad we can fill your bag addictions. We have one more more purse, and then we have some wallets. Or maybe we have more than another purse. I don't know. No, that's it. Um, okay, those are all wallets. I have no idea how much this thing is. I gotta look. It says new. Yeah, I know they're new. They're all new. Oh, thought maybe you you were using them, bringing them back. Yeah, I'm reusing them. <laughs> you girls had best start behaving yourselves. This is the Wrangler Buckle Crossbody made by Montana West. So Montana West makes these and they are Wrangler Buckle Collection Crossbodies, Antique Silver Buckle on the flap, magnetic button closure, Accented with silver studs, top zipper closure. Inside of the bag includes two zipper pockets and two open pockets and a zipper pocket on back. An adjustable crossbody strap. Okay, price. $30 and I only have black left. I only have black left. It has the horseshoe buckle on it. There's all your pockets in here. The zipper, zipper back pocket is right there. And then you have your leather strap. This is a crossbody. It's quilted. This is made by Montana West for Wrangler. $30 on this. Why all these cute bags? I don't know. I don't know. Somebody asked for purses one day, so I just started ordering some. That's all that happened. All right. These here are the Trinity wallets. Now, anybody knows Montana West? Trinity is their top brand. Um, these here are the Montana West Trinity Wallets. Let's see, accented with belt buckle, button closure on the front, multiple card slots, and two long slot compartments. Zipper closure on the back with single compartment divided by a medium zippered pocket. Trinity Ranch logo plate on the back. And I can tell you right now, these here we're selling for $18. And this little tag inside here, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. $44. $44.99. These are Trinity Ranch. I'm not kidding you. This is like Montana's West's top brand right here. Montana, Montana West Trinity Wallets. We have the zipper on the back. With the pockets on the inside. Super soft material. It's almost like a suede. We have black. We have green. These are $18. Black, green, or brown. Black, green, or brown on the Trinity wallets. They are $18. Purple. Okay, Stace. 
the temptation. I know, it's killer. So Stacy Montalvo would like a green and purple saddle cover. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> There's a purple. And we only have one green, so. Yes, they are Western saddle covers. They are $8. They do not have the fenders, so though. They just have the skirting of the saddle. And Carrie Hildesham wants a black. Can you give me that one? So I, can... I can give you this one. Hmm. Kim Haas will take a purple saddle cover. Okay, so these here are Trim Trinity Walk Trinity. Huh. Oh my God, I can't talk. Trinity Ranch wallets from Montana West. Trinity Ranch is one of the top brands. It's like anything you buy from Mon Montana West. If it's Trinity Ranch, it's the most expensive they have. And like these here retail for if you were to buy these from Montana West, forty four ninety nine. Eighteen bucks. We have green, black, and brown left. Green, black, and brown. Andrea McKell would like a brown. All right, so we have our clocks, horse running clocks. They're $18, and we have six. Is that right? No, I only got three down here. Three, and this one's four? No, that'd be three. Okay, so we have four of them. Because there's one in the box over oh, yeah, here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we have four of the clocks. I was sniffing it, right? <laughs> Linda Woodbury would like a brown wallet. I wish I was doing jello shots, but I wasn't. I wasn't. I'm innocent. Wait a minute. I'm not done with that. I'm not done with that. Okay, a brown, brown, brown. Yeah, Linda Woodbury up on the top shelf here, I put it. I think I want to do pudding shots. I like jello shots though. Those those work for me. Anybody interested in the ho running horse clocks? They're $18. Oh, I want some. We go. <laughs> $18 on the running horse clocks. Nada, nobody. Two hundred of them, yeah. Yeah, these clocks are pretty. Jen wants two horse clocks.
He's been bugging for a clock. You didn't get it yet, Susan? <laughs> All right. So, I'm going to show some tack sets, which I have this. Throw them on the floor now, old lady. They're all hooked together in a big clock. <laughs> oh, Andrea McKell would like a horse clock. Okay, that's the last one. That's the last one? No, oh, there's four. Yeah, we got one over here still. Must be slow mail. It, it's either UPS or priority mail. That's the only two ways I send now. The last time I sent parcel post, the person never got it. I never got it back. So, no more of that. <laughs> priority mail or UPS. These here have nice, super heavy buckles on them, too, by the way. These here is a... Uh, how many pieces? I forget. I forget how many pieces it is. Pieces. It's like a six or seven piece. Eight. Oh. I don't friggin' know. <laughs> Big lag tonight, huh? Seems like there's a lot of people coming on on Tuesday nights now. It used to be only me and like a couple other people. Now I look and there's like six people on on Tuesday. So... Not just horse sales, but, I mean, other stuff. All right. This here is the floral set. The floral set. And you're going to get the one-ear head stall. The wither strap. You want these? The breast collar. Oh, snap. You get a set of bit guards. Set of spur straps. They also have the matching heavy duty buckles on them. Okay, and then it also comes with a halter. I'll call it a head stall. I already showed the head stall. This halter has the, the throat snap. It's got the adjustable chin with the metal grommets. It is horse size. Nice halter. The whole set's going to be $125. So you can get the whole set, all them pieces I just showed you, for $125. Yeah, thought I lost him again. You hung him on the other side. I was going to tell you I that. I was ready to say, what? <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> Poor Nova. This one here is the American flag set. Get your stars and stripes. Blue raspberry would be my favorite. That's the that's the, I get a blue raspberry colada from from Duncan's all the time. Okay, you're going to get the matching bit guards, matching spur straps. Okay. You don't want these? Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to leave them for you today. Wither strap. Anybody who does parades or anything, this would be a cool set. Fourth of July parades and stuff. Oh, well, those could work something else. 
Look at that. Got the gold. Yeah. I'm not done that yet. Oh, okay. The halter, same as the other one, all adjustable. And the breast collar. After a while, they all taste the same, right? They're all good. These sets are all 125 tonight. 125 tonight. 125. That's 20. They usually they're 145. I dropped them ten dollars last week. Ten dollars this week. Come the first of the year, they're going back to where they normally are. <laughs> this is sale price. So this one here is the cheetah and sunflower. And it has the brass um, flower flowers on it, spots. I can't say it. I can't think tonight. It's not working. <laughs> Comes with the wither strap. The breast collar. These sets are really very nice. They're not like really chintzy, heavy. Surprised I still have as many as I have. Bit guards. And the halter. And a one of your head stall. Also has a really nice buckles on it. I like the heavy duty buckles. I like the heavy duty ones. <laughs> Am I missing anything other than all the jello shots everybody's doing? I need to stop. I can't stop, Susan. I gotta sell them. They gotta go. This one here is probably my favorite one. This is the silver set. Well, I say silver set, but it's sunflower. But it has the silver spotting on it. This makes it look better to me. It has the silver spotting, all these... A complete set like the other ones. So one, two, oh, goodness, <laughs> three pieces. <laughs> God damn, I losing things. First straps is four. Bit guards is five, and breast collar is six. So there are six piece sets. <laughs> six piece sets on these. Super nice sets. Get a whole lot of them. Six pieces, one twenty five. Six pieces for one twenty five. Oh, we are you running over? <laughs> Sound like bubble wrap. It is. Oh. All right. Nobody wants them. All right. This halter here, this set. Only have this one. These sets here, for some reason, cost so much money. They do have a brass, big brass snap on them. And they are $25. It's the only one I got. 25 bucks. Oops. Almost lost you. Almost lost you. <laughs> All right. We have the Equipings. Equipings. Um... Yep. 
that's gone. I can't remember. Oh, crap. Over there. Found him. Yeah, I found him too. There, 750, and Norma just knocked him all on the floor, right? Just one color. Oh, just all one that. color. <gasps> We're almost, I, I don't know. We only have seven blue left, so. All right, these are your Equipings. These are your safety tie releases. What size is the Christmas tree? All right, so this is how they operate. This here is the lock ring. Slides off. You put your, tie your rope through here. And then this Christmas tree, if you put it all the way out like that, it would be like for a horse that doesn't highly, like a mini or a pony. Um, no pressure at all to pull it off. If you put it all the way on the last one, this is how I keep mine. Um, it takes quite a bit for them to pull them apart. Once they ping, this little thing here might be a little hard to find. Let me know if you can't find any. I think I have a few laying around here still. But they started, now I, they charge me for them, so they're not free anymore. Anyways, Equipings. This would go to your solid object, your trailer, your cross ties, whatever. So this would go to the solid side. And then you tie your lead rope or your strap off of that, okay? So these are 750 I have purple... Wrecking the joint. Noma's wrecking the joint. That's Some, right, I'm someone's got to have that title. <laughs> we have red, purple, red, black. Seven blue left. Blue, pink, green, and yellow. Hey, you gotta go high. Those aren't for sale. Oh. I already told you none of the treat, none of those. Well, that's fine, but not the one I've already been feeding my dogs out of, probably. Oh, I didn't even know you did. <laughs> Norma, Norma, Norma. Two pings, a purple and a blue. Okay, Carrie. Anybody else interested in Equipings? We have all the colors available at this time. All the colors available. We have yellow, green, pink, blue, red, pink, and purple, and black. And, and, and. All right. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Norma, did you load this? Load what? <laughs> so when I picked up one thing, everything fell off. No. <laughs> did you plan it that way? Norma is wearing her jammies. She always wears no, her jammies. Not. It's my. Oh, it's not. She got a t shirt on. My work clothes. Those aren't work clothes. I wore them today to work. It was crazy sweater day. Oh, well, that ain't crazy. Other than a big fat bulldog. <laughs> <laughs> it was hotter than hell with this sweater. Oh, she said, has Norma quit wearing her jammies? No. No, she didn't quit. No. Where the heck's a column? It went flying. That's why I asked if you planned that. Okay, so the ombre halters. How many of these do we have left? Just what I have in my hand? Um, you got a green and a purple one back there. So there's six left. Yeah. So I have two teal left. Those are teal. 
Yep. Okay. All right. So these are your ombre halters. They are thirteen fifty. They come with the swivel throat snap, adjustable chin, grommets. They don't pull out. They last longer. We have purple. We have red. We have two teal. We have two purple, right? Is that what the other color was? Yeah. I have two in teal, two in purple, and one in blue. Keep catching my freaking, my burn on everything. Norma is so cute. <laughs> That's what they're saying, Norma. They're saying yeah, you're so cute. Yeah, yeah. She's so cute. If Paul could only hear him, he'd probably be saying, oh, yeah, I'll live with her for a while. <laughs> Margaret Drummond wants a purple and a teal. You want one of each, Margaret? Man, you're going to knock that rack over no, on my freaking I'm head. I picked up that thing. bag. Oy vey. Okay, I'm getting a what was I getting a a purple. Yeah. And a teal. Oh, One of each. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. So I still have a teal, a purple, a blue, and a red left. If anybody's interested. Teal, a purple, a blue, and a red. Vicki Kirkhoff would like a red. Okay. Blue, teal, and purple. Jeez, oh, I probably ought to put the colors in here. I'm an idiot. Well, it would be nice. <laughs> Yeah, would be nice. Green halter red. Okay. We won't be allowed to play where? Or we're not allowed to play anywhere. Sorry, Margaret. No more red. All we have left is a teal and a blue. Right? Is that correct? Teal, blue, and purple. A teal, blue, and purple left, Margaret. Margaret would like the blue. So I got you for a teal, purple, and blue. They're really nice halters. Nice, nice. So all we have left is a teal and a purple. Teal and a purple ombre halters. There's only one lead. No. Is that correct? Is there enough leads for all the collars we have? Four, yeah. One, two, okay. three. Four, How many four. medium and large? What are those? Large. Okay, so there's three large and one medium? Yeah. All right, we have the black and white um, reflective collars and dog leashes. <laughs> reflective collar and dog leashes. Um... We have three in the large and one in the medium. And they all come with leashes. $12 for the set. The large is 22 inches. Well, 17 to 22 inches. And the mediums are 19 inches to... Oh no, 14 to 19 inches. Merry-go-round. 
I love going fast. You kidding me? I love going fast on everything. Horses, cars, motorcycles, horses, horses, horses. Okay, come on, you guys. Dog collars with the leash. They come with a matching leash. Nice big handle. Snap. Up to 22 inches, up to 17 inches. If they're too big, you can always add holes and cut them down. You just cut them in a V-shape like so. $12 for the set. Vicki Kirkhoff wants too large. One smaller one or medium and one large left. One medium and one large left? Yeah. Guys are killing us. Well, what are they talking about? <laughs> Something about let's put them on a merry-go-round and going fast. I don't know. I missed the whole conversation. Okay. It's like I'm out in left field. Stephanie Llewellyn would like the last large. Okay. Got that. So all we have left is a medium set. I got you, Steph. All right, moving forward. Here we go. We got some cocktail puzzles. Black Russian. No. Sea Breeze. That don't look too bad. I'm a white Russian drinker. Pina Colada. Had those on a cruise once. All right, this is a jigsaw puzzle. Left field spinning. Come on, you guys. Jigsaw puzzle. It is 500. I think 500. Yeah, 500 piece cocktail lover puzzle. 500 piece cocktail lover jigsaw puzzle. And it is going to be $6. $6 for the cocktail puzzle. Left field spinning right. Now what? I'm missing the whole thing. I don't know what she's talking about. Okay. Moving on. Yeah, moving right on. Moving along here. We're moving along. So, this is the kitty puzzle. We only have one cat puzzle left, right? Yep. Okay, we're going to let it go for $8 tonight. Pretty kitty. $8 on the puzzle. 1,000 pieces. Pretty kitty. I don't know if anybody can can't do it. Okay, Cheryl Pasillo. Every piece you match, take a drink. There you go. I could play that. Cheryl Pasillo wants a cocktail puzzle. I have two of those if anybody's interested in another one. I'll put that down. Stephanie Llewellyn wants the kitty puzzle. <laughs> kitty puzzle. <laughs> Shit. 
All right. Next up, we have the dogs playing poker. There's Norma's dog right there. You got two of them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See? There's no one, is it? Not the bulldog. He got the cigarette. Yeah. Husky's got the cigar. It's called the bluff. Thousand piece puzzle. This one here is going to be nine dollars. Thousand piece puzzle. It's called the bluff. It's got all the dogs playing poker. Nine dollars, thousand pieces. For every piece you match, you take a drink. A thousand pieces. <laughs> You're pretty loaded. <laughs> All right, this is a thousand piece Arabian greeting puzzle. Arabian greeting. Puzzle's going to be $8 tonight. $8 for the Arabian greeting puzzle. I got like a dozen of them if anybody's interested. $8 is pretty much rock bottom pricing on these. Thousand pieces, 20 by 28, Arabian. Nobody? All right. I got some cockatiel food. Anybody have any cockatiels? Cockatiel. Lefebvre's, and these are five-pound buckets. Yep, five-pound bucket, premium daily pellets. These are brand new, never been opened. Uh, good, best used by 2-8-2024. Cheryl Priscilla wants an Arabian puzzle. Good night, Linda. All right, so this is your cockatiel food. These buckets normally go for $32 to $35. We've been selling them for $25. I'm going to let them go for $20 tonight. My favorite cockatiel food. If you have a cockatiel, not, I might have to get one so I can feed it. I'd rather give it this stuff. I'd rather have one of these. No, we're not taking Paul's bird. Almost had it. No. All right. <laughs> Next, we have the Nutriberries. The Faber Classic Nutriberries All Natural um, Parrot Food. This is your parrot food. These are your Nutriberries. This is not open. <laughs> These are unopened. This is your Nutriberries parrot food. If you have a parrot, they're going to love these. This bucket's $25. Quarter of 12. Holy crap. <laughs> My clock stopped the other night. This is funny. My clock stopped the other night. I panicked that it was quarter of 12. So I went to bed. While I woke up, it was like 3 o'clock in the morning. Couldn't figure out why. Came out here, it was still quarter of 12. Mm. <laughs> I must have went to bed really early. <laughs> it wasn't tired. I just figured it was late. I better go to bed. I'm not going to get up. All right, y'all. We're going to pick a number. Pick a number between 1 and 25. 
go. The winner is going to get a container of horse and dog treats. What you do? Nothing. Oh, I better watch the numbers. Shit. Nope, nobody got it yet. No, 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 no. One through twenty five. Come on, y'all. Bobby Hagerman. It was lucky number seven. Lucky number seven. Bobby Hagerman got it. Lucky number seven. All right. You can all stop guessing. So, Bobby, you got a container of... Horse and dog treats, little hearts. They are um, from Rockin' D Ranch. They are gingerbread horse and dog treats. No sugar added. Kimberly Haas sent 200 stars. You guys can stop guessing. Bobby Hagerman got the, got the prize. <laughs> it's still going. You gotta have to tell me who? Bobby Hagerman. Oh, Kimberly Haas. Kim. Yeah. H A A S. <laughs> All right, Bobby, I got your name on here. This will go out with your blanket. She did order a blanket tonight, so that'll be good. You guys better stop guessing because we're all done. <laughs> we're all done. Last sale before Christmas, right? Here's today. Poor Tina. She must have a delay. So she's typing them all in right now. Look at They're all coming up. Tina Schrader, Tina Schrader, Tina Schrader. Sorry, Tina, but Bobby Hagerman got it. And I better put you in here for a prize because Lord knows I'm known to forget them. All right. All right, everybody. It's been fun. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so giddy tonight. I just am. <laughs> everybody have a great night. And Merry Christmas to you all. Merry Christmas. I hope you have a great holiday. And we will see you. It'll be before next year, right? Next Tuesday. Well, what's next Tuesday? Not next year. No. We'll see you on the 27th. I hope you guys all have an amazing Christmas. Thank you. Love you all. And I'll have your invoices out tonight. Okay. If you don't get your invoice tonight or by tomorrow morning, make sure you let me know. Cause that means something went hanky. All right. Good night, everybody.